welcome to Lucky Part 13 of Let's Play Clergy's Big Chat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm done. So, um, after about, I don't know, three minutes of looking around... <laughs> Excuse me. After about three minutes of searching around after I finished recording part 12, I found the last three keys. And, um... Uh, I'm embarrassed at where they were because they were right out in the open both times. Here, I'm going to show you some screenshots of where the last three were. There was one of them that was by itself, um, where I really should have seen it, uh, right on top of a flagpole. And then there were the two others that were uh, just right out there in the open, right above some guy who I'm going to name Greg. But uh, as you can see from the select screen I have all 1200 coins so far finally and uh, as you may or may not be noticing uh, I think the lag is gone and that was really stupid of me to get hit no nope, maybe not oops but uh, <laughs> I think the lag was due to the fact that congregate which is the website where I played these Flash games, was uh, was going for maintenance or something like that. So it was kind of messy uh, in Part 12, and it might in fact be there in Part 13, but uh, I hope that doesn't surprise you too much that I record multiple parts in one day. Or did I just blow your mind? <laughs> anyway, that's the end of Chapter 2, Level 2. And so, Clarence arrives at work for another day's dreary drudgery to fill the man's pockets. You'd best be sure to perform well. Ladies aren't too impressed by the unemployed. Maybe you can even get that promotion, dot, dot, dot. I got a new achievement! Which is probably for, yes, in fact, collecting all of the coins on level two. I am a gutter looter. Yeah! All right. Now begins part... Now begins Chapter 3, The Office. Welcome to work! You can talk to NPCs using up, just like how you read signs. So try doing that to find out more about what to do. Hello. Oh, an actual dialogue. Welcome to Generic Company. Clarence Lardbottom, is it? Your cubicle is the first floor room too. Good day to you. Oh, but the lift's off due today for no, for clear, for no clear reason. So I'm afraid you'll just have to climb the ladder in the lift shaft instead. Have fun! Thanks! Alright, uh... I'm gonna look real quick. So I have, wow, 1,400 coins to collect in this area. And, uh, finally, the work tasks part of your menu will come into play. There will be several various, as said before, ooh, what's that? Must collect! A memorandum. A new task has been unlocked. Scorpions! The office has been hit with a scorpion infestation. Apparently one of them came in with some cargo, and they've been breeding like lower-class teenagers. Yes. Take out ten of the buggers, you can find them all over the office. You can monitor your progress from the entry screen. So, let's go to the entry screen right now and go here. Look at that. Now we have a work task. Get rid of ten scorpions. I have none, obviously, because I just picked up the, the, uh, the, the memorandum, the task, the what have you. So, of course, that's the. those are the six coins in the very beginning. And I'm going to search just to make sure that there weren't any scorpions or anything that I missed like last time. And apparently this game is going to be laggy as hell again for some reason. I don't know why. All right. This is the elevator shaft. And we're going into the first floor. I'm talk to this guy real quick. Greetings, fellow employee. You'll find your cubicle through this door here, marked 2. You can access your computer from there, as I'm sure you're eager to do. Don't just don't let the boss catch you looking up the naughties. Again. <laughs> well, through here is Clarence's cubicle, which we'll find very shortly. Hey there, Clarence, your cubicle is up the ladder there, then to the right a bit. You'll recognize your monitor's pink desktop screen thing. I'm not sure how they let you get away with that, honestly. I mean, everything else has to be uniform. Can't let people express themselves creatively, or else they'll be like rebels and stuff. Oh, how true you are. 
How disturbingly true. So let's look up, let's find our cubicle. Did I pass it? Possibly, I don't know. I'm apparently really bad with this nose thing, but if you notice here, ah, our first tip of this section. She really admires niceness in a man. She isn't a fan of violence or machismo. She just wants someone gentle and caring. Aw. <laughs> Programmer, you sir are going on a date? I wish I knew what that was like. All I know about women is what I've read on the internet. Would it's like to actually talk to one? Maybe I'll ask my parents about it at home tonight. Oh, God, that's really sad. Why is... That guy looked like it was glowing there for a second. Where it is you're going on a date tonight? You? I mean, you? Really? What are you... Are you joking or what? I can't even begin to imagine that scenario. It'd be like the boss coming down here and giving us all raises for no reason. Why do you get a date, but I'm still so lonely? So, so lonely. It's not fair. Nothing's fair. I should just end it all. But he doesn't. He just walks away. All right. Where the hell is my computer? Is it this one? There it is. I got the awesome... What the hell is that, a hamster? I got a new task. Analyze the latest trends. We want to know what the dim masses think about everything. Search around the internet for 12 pieces of information. Do you want to do progress from the enter screen? Yes, of course. So what is this? Antivirus. Okay, so, uh... This is where you're going to spend a fair amount of your time... Oh, right, I remember this part from a long time ago. Um, log off. We'll do that a little bit later, I think. So, let's surf the internet for a while. Oh, Christ, this is what the internet apparently looks like. Horrible. But we have a virtual clearance, which is kind of cool. And you should avoid those little sparks because they will hurt you badly. Like it just did to me right there. Okay, and uh, also, for note, uh, that these sections will act... Well, if you couldn't tell from the sound effect, they will act exactly the same way as doors do, in that they uh, will save your progress and various other things. All right, so uh, Chapter 3 is a bit more challenging than Chapter 2 and Chapter 1, obviously, uh, in that... Well, besides the 1,400 coins that I'm going to have to collect, there are all the office tasks, and also... Ah, I've obtained one of my 12 pieces of information. Uh, but any of the items that you will have to collect or deal with, as far as the tasks are concerned, will not show up until you pick up the task. So, if, for example, later on I find another task to be done within the computer, uh, I have to come back in here and do this entire section again. So, if that happens, I apologize. But again, I have not played this section in a very long time. Probably at least a year, possibly more. I don't actually remember. I don't know when this game came out. But I have not played this section in a long time. But, um... Anyway, uh, besides the fact that you've got all that stuff to deal with, it is a much more challenging area. Because there are lots of, uh... Spike pits and, uh and uh, sparks, as you can see. A lot of time-based jumps that you need to make sure that you don't get hit, like, right there, which I did, which was silly, but you got to do, deal with stuff like this, which is a little annoying, but, you know, not, not like, super challenging or anything like that. And there's our th third piece of information, I believe. Check the menu. Yes, that's three. I only need nine more. To avoid the sparks so I don't die. I do recall vaguely that the one time I did play through here, I died a lot in the internet area, on the computer in general. Yep. Okay, let's see. What's that? I forget. Oh, it's like a door to another area of the internet! And there's another Greg? Did I call him Greg? Oh, I didn't even see that. <laughs> Rather foolishly, did not even see that spark coming, and I'm almost dead already. Wow. Yeah, there's probably going to be quite a few deaths in here. Why are there people in here? That's really weird. Now here's our second piece of information. Her favorite variety of flowers are tulips. Good to know, I guess. Try not to die. Alright, good. And I guess I'll have to access that place later. As I've stated many times before, it's been a long time since I've played this part. So I may or may not remember where I need to go. More than likely the answer to that is I will not remember where I need to go. But hey, it'll be a... A day of discovery for all, for all of us. And there's piece of information number four, yeah! We're a third of the way through this. Wait for that. 
to be very careful not to die here. Because there's a safe point. I'm actually going to die intentionally so I can refill my life bar. Shock! Alright. <laughs> I almost ran into a spark right there. That would have been hilarious and very sad. I should probably... Ah, I had to scratch my nose. I had to scratch my nose. Yep. Alright. Those four coins. Yes, that was the entire point behind going over there. As far as I know, unless there's another task that revol revolves... that involves me going there. But who knows? I don't remember. Another piece of information! Oh. Oh, well. Okay, careful. 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 All right. Uh-oh. <laughs> and just as I say that, I get hit by... Oh, good, another safe spot. Whew. Okay. And now we're halfway done with that first, with that first task. Yes! Six pieces of information, right? Yeah! Halfway done. Awesome. Okay, let's keep going. There's another piece of information. Make the jump! Yeah! Oh no, I didn't expect that spark to come back so quickly. I'm about to die, that's a bad thing. Because that would mean that I'd have to... No, oh, there's another piece of information. Yeah! I think I'm going to go... Actually, ooh. Don't want to die. Don't want to die. Certainly don't want to die right now after I've collected all that stuff. That would suck. So I'm going to go back. I know this is kind of a bad plan, I think, but whatever. I'm going back here anyway. I'm going to try and get back down here. Save. Try not to die. Save. Kill myself so I can get the full... Start. Okay, so I get full health. And then move on again. See, there's some strategy involved in this game. Sometimes, I guess, a little bit. Uh, can I make that? Yeah! I'm going to wait this time, because I remember. Jump! Wait for it. Jump! Okay. This part looks like it's going to be very annoying. Run! Run, Clarence, run! Okay, Ah, uh, oh, shoot. <laughs> I jumped a little bit too quickly. Uh, how am I going to get over there? Okay, I see. Climb the virtual ladder. Ladders for your three coins, Clarence. Okay, wait for that thing to go away, and I believe we're going to find ourselves right back up here. Cool. So, uh... Going through that one area, I collected two-thirds of all the pieces of information that I need. Ooh, that looked like it was probably... Oh, shoot. It's probably a bit of a dangerous jump, but I made it with no real problems. And there's another one. All right, cool. We're, we're now three-quarters of the way done with this task. This is what I was talking about when I meant timing-based stuff, and that you have to really be careful not to run into too many sparks. Okay... Tried to get back there, but I decided not to, because I would have been hit. Uh, see what I mean? It's like, sparks everywhere! I should have gotten hit there, I think. Run, 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 run! All right. Okay. All right. Ooh, can I make it? Yes. Door. Good. That means that I... <sighs> Saved again. Those red blocks. You'll see what those are important for a little bit later. Really important, just kind of there. Okay. Coins. Oh, that was dumb of me. I guess, in fact, we'll see that a bit sooner than I thought. Can I make the jump? Yes. Save. Kill myself. <laughs> Go back to full health. See, I'm intelligent, I guess, at some some aspects of this game. Okay, be careful here. This area kind of sucks! Because of all the disappearing blocks. Alright! Oh, thank goodness there's a safe spot right there. Some more coins and one of those. Probably some kid pirating. Oh! I had to give him a. L oh no, there's a ladder right there. <laughs> Doy! I thought those were spikes. Car! Alright, this is a virtual car. And I get hit by that stupid spark. So I always get hit by the sparks. And I got hit by that somehow. That sucks. Whoop! Whoop! 
Whoop! Now we've got our sweet virtual car uh, in which we are going to drive around and destroy the internet! Or just, you know... Whoop, 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 whoop. There we go. About. Save. For no reason. Woo! Coins! Not getting hurt by sparks. Very annoying sparks. Alright. Crash. Crash. Crash, 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 crash. Many crashes! Many running through things! This segment's gone a lot longer than I was expecting it to, but I don't care, because I want to finish that one task. Alright. What's there? Nothing? Okay. Alright, let's... Careful. What's that old man doing on the internet? Old people shouldn't be on the internet. Oh, there's something there. Okay. Weird. There'd be something there. I was wrong! Okay. Time it right! There's coins! Yeah! Ten more coins. In my pocket! Come on, get, get in the car! There we go. Yes! That was all that trouble just to drive ten feet. Well, maybe more like, I don't know, thirty feet? I don't know. I'm not good with distance. Drive, you fool! I bet you there's something that was supposed to be there, or will be there in a future task or something. I don't know. But, uh... I suppose for now I can at least pick up the coins, so I don't have to think about those later. Despite all of the sparks, they're everywhere! Whew, I almost got hit there, and I probably should have been hit there. Oh, this looks like it's going to be annoying. can't actually make that jump, can I? Or can I? Uh, yeah! Woo! Ten more coins! Get on the car. Get on the car. There we go. Alright, I guess we're done in here. So I'm going to save. So we're done here for now. I have a feeling we're going to be coming back to do something else. What exactly, I don't know. But I'm sure I'll find out in due time. Alright, so uh, I guess that's all of this area. I still have nine, so I still need three more of those pieces of information to collect. Whoop! No, no, no. Uh, this room always gets me kind of twisted and weird up. Because uh, of all the sparks that are moving in different air and different. Jump! Alright. Don't want to get hit by that thing. And now I'm only doing that for saving. Whoa. Okay. Uh, what? Oh, shoot. Okay, let's see. Trying to just okay. There's there are two pieces of information in here. How exactly I'm going to get to them? I'm not completely sure. I think it will involve going through here though. Ooh. Through here, perhaps? Yeah. All right. There we go. That bastard to move. Bastard sparks. Cool. All right. Ten out of twelve. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, what? Oh, damn it. Well, that's okay. I didn't lose too much progress. Plus, now I know how to get to these little... Oh, god damn it. I am failure. Give me them coins! Give me that information! What? What? I don't even know what I was doing there! What the fuck is wrong with me? All that. All right. One more piece of information, and then I'm done with that first task. Yes. Good. Ah, tried to make it there without getting hit. Now I'm probably gonna die again. Yeah. Okay. Well, there's got to be another safe point somewhere around here. Ah, the final piece of information. I'm done with that task. Yes. It only took me 20 minutes. Oh crap. Okay, don't want to get hit. Don't want to get hit. Okay. Whew. Okay, the spikes were there. All right. Ooh. Whoa. No. Must get last coin. Go away, spikes. Sparks. Go away, spikes, too. I don't like you either. I don't like neither of you. Whoa. Ah! 
Oh, I almost lost a lot of progress. Oh, grr! Fucking sparks! Stupid. I'm stupid. Apparently. Okay. This one's first. Except I missed one. Alright, good. I have now completed that task again. Can I make that? Okay, that was really risky. I did not even see that spark coming. I was not paying attention. Okay, at least I got the save. Ah! Where did all these people come from? All these prostitutes and these Gregs and... At least I'm back up to full health. That's something. Go away. Go away. There we go. Oh, this has been a really stressful first part. Ah, good. Yet another visage tome. She lives to party. She's a self-proclaimed party animal, and parties are what make her feel alive. Okay. This is that part that we were just in a little while ago, where I was wondering how exactly to get onto this side. And now I know. Oh, wow. I was not paying much attention there at all. Get the climb. No, wait. I don't even need to go there. I just need to go here. Okay. Now, um... I do believe that this will be the end of this, uh... Extra long... Oh, wow. That was cool. Uh, extra long part 13. Of Les Blake Clarence's Big Chance. Uh, one task completed out of I don't know how many. I don't remember. But I'll find out pretty soon, I'm sure. And uh, we have... How many of those? I got three more of those uh, tips. So, and 229 coins. So uh, be sure to tune in for part 14, wherein I keep working on working and getting stuff completed and getting more money and being awesome. And yeah. All right. See you, see you, see you later. Fill the man's pockets. You'd best be sure to perform well. Ladies aren't too impressed by the unemployed. Maybe you can even get that promotion. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, I got a new achievement! Which is probably for, yes, in fact, collecting all of the coins on level two. I am a gutter looter. Yeah! All right. Now begins part... Now begins chapter three. The office. Welcome to work! You can talk to NPCs using up, just like how you read signs. So try doing that to find out more about... To Lucky Pot 13 of Let's Play Clarence's Big Chance! <laughs> okay, I'm done. So, um, right above some guy who I'm going to name Greg. But, uh, as you can see from the select screen. I have all 1,200 coins so far. Finally. And, uh, as you may or may not be noticing, uh, I think the lag is gone. And that was really stupid of me to get hit. Nope, maybe not. 
Oops. But, uh... After about... I don't know. Three minutes of looking... <laughs> Excuse me. After about three minutes of searching around after I finished recording part 12, I found the last three keys. And, uh... I'm embarrassed at where they were because they were right out in the open both times. Here, I'm going to show you some screenshots of where the last three were. There was one of them that was by itself, um, where I really should have seen it, uh, right on top of a flagpole. And then there were the two others that were uh, just right out there in the open. <laughs> I think the lag was due to the fact that Congregate, which is the website where I played these Flash games, was uh, was going for maintenance or something like that. So it was kind of messy uh, in part 12, and it may in fact be there in part 13, but uh, I hope that doesn't surprise you too much that I record multiple parts in one day, or did I just BLOW YOUR MIND?! <laughs> anyway, that's the end of Chapter 2, Level 2. And so Clarence arrives at work for another day's dreary drudgery to 